Roman leader Mark Antony was already married to Octavia Minor when he married what famous Egyptian? Uh, Cleopatra. What colorful rock duo claimed to be brother and sister what were, but were actually a divorced couple? Uh, the White Stripes? What was known as Seward's Folly when the U.S. purchased it in 1867? Uh, yeah, pass. What tree measurement do foresters usually make at four feet above ground level? Um, height. What decade was the first Indianapolis 500 race held in? Uh, the 50th. What was known as Seward's Folly when the U.S. purchased it in 1867? Um, I don't know, Texas. Time. All right, Tammy, how'd you do? <laughs> not great, but at least I didn't swear. You did, you did great at not swearing, 100% on that. Hold on. <laughs> Here comes the wings. Been waved. Give him the wings wave. Strides back in, ready to roll. Ready to roll. All right, Hot Wings, your turn. Tammy's score is in the books. Are you ready? Yes. Dumber than the show trivia, Hot Wings edition for $400 for Tammy. It's Hot Wings' turn in three, two, one. Roman leader Mark Antony was already married to Octavia Minor when he married what famous Egyptian? Cleopatra. What colorful rock duo claimed to be brother and sister but were actually a divorced couple? Uh, the White Stripes. What was known as Seward's Folly when the U.S. purchased it in 1867? Um, I think that's the Erie Canal. What tree measurement do foresters usually make at four feet above ground level? Say that again. What tree measurement do foresters usually make at four feet above ground level? Um, the trunk diameter. What decade was the first Indianapolis 500 race held in? Um, that was the, uh, mm, the 19... <sighs> the first decade of the 1900s. The 1900s. The zeros. Time. The aughts. I don't know how to say it. Time. Time a minute ago. You get the idea. How excited did you do? Um, I got the last one wrong. Um, but otherwise, okay. Uh, let us welcome Tammy back. Hi. Hi, Tammy. Let's score this game. Roman leader Mark Antony was already married to Octavia Minor when he married what famous Egyptian? Hot Wings said Cleopatra. Tammy said Cleopatra. Tell Myrtle yeah. to stop being that workplace <laughs> troublemaker. Yeah, you just uh, kidding. tell her to uh, stop. The answer is Cleopatra. Myrtle, mommy's on the radio. You're fine. <laughs> Uh, radio. Both correct, tied at one. Don't be the most song. important entertainment option we have today, Myrtle. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Number two. What colorful rock duo claimed to be brother and sister but were actually a divorced couple? How we said the White Stripes. That is also what Tammy said. Both correct, tied at two. What was known as Seward's Folly when the U.S. purchased it in 1867? Hot Wings said the Erie Canal. Again, stupid. Tammy said Texas. <laughs> By Texas, we right. fought a war with Mexico and kind of kind of took it. <laughs> Didn't buy the Erie Canal. It was in a place where we, right. we, we dug it. We yeah. built it. Yeah, we made it. Yeah, that was really a dumb answer. The answer is Alaska. I was actually going to 
say Alaska, too, and I was like, no, oh, that's stupid. That would yeah. have been a much better strategy. You should have. <laughs> uh, yeah, what decade stupid. was the first Indianapolis 500 race held in? Hot Wings said the 19 aughts. Tammy said the 1950s. Both incorrect. It yeah, was the teens. in the teens. I know. All right, this last one. Might need some help on this. What tree measurement do foresters usually make at four feet above ground level? Now, Hot Wings said diameter. Tammy said height, which would be weird because the forester would be like, I'll be damned, this one's four feet tall. They're all four feet tall. Every one of them is four feet tall. Son of a bitch. This whole forest, they all look so different. Every damn one of them, four feet tall. Why don't you cut it down? Put it in the stack of four-foot trees. You guys will never believe this. All trees are the same height. All of them. Now, the answer that Trivial Pursuit was looking for is circumference. Girth. Yeah. Which, to me, would be circumference, Mm -hmm. not diameter. Yeah, because the diameter can change depending on where you're at on the trunk. So Hot Wings is not correct, and we go to the top. So, yeah, I, I even I would say that that was not correct. I should have said circumference. I'm glad we did that. I wasn't sure as well. Uh, so it is a tie. Tied at two. We go to the clocks. The winning time, 52.75. Losing time, 101.12. And even with that weirdness at the end, Hot Wings is the winner. Mm. A couple of sucky wins in a row, but I'll take them. Yeah. Bad guesses. It was an honor to play you, Hot Wings. Uh, The pleasure was all yours, Tammy. Thank you. Yes. (laughs) Thank you, Tammy. (laughs) Yep, thank you. I kid, of course. Raised Myrtle right.